I think that we underestimate the impact of stalking. Stalking has massive impact on women's trauma. Uh, if women are leaving their places of home, in some cases women are relocating in different countries because they don't feel safe. The impact and the long lasting effects of stalking on these victims is immeasurable. These attacks are persistent and aggressive and will not on long into the night. Well, stalking is an insidious crime. It causes physical and psychological damage to victims. Through this legislation we want to help frontline practitioners to recognise stalking when it occurs, to feel confident that they're able to investigate and prosecute it effectively. We want victims to feel confident that they're going to be listened to, that they're going to be believed. We want to help them feel protected. We want them to feel safe. I moved into an apartment of my own and I was afraid that he would find out where I was living so I asked everyone not to give out my address. Then one morning I opened my door to go to work and he was there. But it's very important to note that we do now have new stalking legislation. Stalking is an offence so anyone who is listening who is experiencing fixated, obsessive, repeated and unwanted behaviours just to know that help and support is available. We also heard today about some of the cases that were brought forward and that have since been prosecuted. So it's, it's good to see the outworkings of that legislation. We really would like to see victims come forward sooner. And there's help and available from uh, organizations like Women's Aid, Rainbow, Victim Support and Men's Advisory Project. But it's really important that we have events like this today to raise awareness it's a multi-agency attendance here and it's great um, that Belfast PCSP has supported this event.